to turn a shorty, so a size two wrap, into a, basically a no-sew ring sling. So what you're gonna need is two sling rings. You wanna make sure that these are proper sling rings. They don't have any joints. You can buy them on slingrings.com. Um, you don't wanna use any sort of craft rings or rings you're gonna find at the hardware store. You need to use something that's safe for your baby. Um, your first step is, like when you're threading a ring sling, you're just going to accordion the fabric to get it all gathered nicely. Then you're gonna take your two rings. This is just sort of like threading like a D belt or anything like that. You go through Mommy. both of the rings Mommy. and then back through one. So pull your fabric through and then make sure that um, your fabric has come through nicely uh, the whole way. Otherwise, if it hasn't, you just want to sort of unfold it and make sure that it's, it's nicely brought through. This will just make it a lot easier to tighten once you actually get uh, everything in there. So then you are going to, with your, Elliot, please stop hitting your brother. Mommy, Thank you. Hold it? Yeah, I can hold that, thanks. Mommy. I'll just stick it right here. I'm gonna put you up in the sling. Why? So now you've basically got your you rings here, your fabric pulled through, it's, it basically just looks like a, if you had a ring sling, this is what it would look like after you pulled the fabric through. You're going to put this up and over your shoulder with this on the inside. So it's covered by the other piece of fabric. I'm just going to readjust myself here because I've had some help from a three-year-old. And spread it out over your shoulder. Pull the fabric underneath your armpit. Accordion it again, just the same way we did when we went through the rings the first time. Back up through the rings. And then down again. Be fussy because it just makes it a lot easier to uh, tighten your ring sling later. But um, don't be afraid to be a little bit fussy and take your time to do this. Um, it is quick and easy once you learn it. But like I said, don't be afraid to be a little bit fussy in the beginning. So as you can see, I now have a nice gathered smooth shoulder. I've got a little bit of fabric back there that um, I could tuck in just for looks. The taper is sometimes on a, on a wrap. Might stick out, but you can just sort of tuck that in. I've got my rings up at corsage. Yeah, I'll put you in. Can you take your shoes off? Oh, you already did, good. Okay, so my one-year-old has left me. I'm gonna just toss my three-year-old up. It's a little bit trickier because he's got longer legs, but it totally can be done. Bend your legs, please. Thank you. <laughs> Your other one. This is a little less glamorous than with a baby. Obviously. <laughs> okay. Slide him over into hip position. <laughs> You're funny. Spread your fabric knee to knee, and then you just tighten it the same way you would tighten a ring sling. Give a little bounce. And there you go. A no-sew ring sling. Easy peasy. Now you don't need ring slings, you can just use shorties.